what's up everybody I uh, hope you guys enjoyed my uh, latest uh, DVD update and like I said if I get any more DVDs and that are supposed to arrive I will definitely do some more uh, updates but uh, for now uh, I figured I'd make a video like I said I was gonna do on uh, well some up upcoming stuff but but more most importantly about uh, uh, saying my thanks and, and uh, showing some respect to some of the people that I've enjoyed watching on YouTube, some of the people I feel who, uh, if I could categorize everything that, uh, you know, into little sections of people who I've enjoyed watching on YouTube, I would pretty much do it like this. 2008, you know, it's, it's almost over, as we all know, and it's nice to take a look at uh, the year, uh, how the year has progressed and whatnot. Uh, YouTube has really gotten big. And, you know, I got to thinking about it. It's like, <clears throat> and maybe this is just a crazy idea or whatnot, but you know, when YouTube had their YouTube live show, uh, they had a lot of people who were, who became really popular on the internet, like, uh, on YouTube, like Fred, and then the guy who, like, uh, mashed everything together, or, or the Blender guy or whatnot, and a few other people. It's like, you know, if I was in charge of, of, uh, of doing a YouTube live show, I would be get I would get some of these people uh, uh, featured on, on a special like that rather than the people like Fred or whatever. Because who? I mean, nothing against Fred, but uh, you know he's a fourteen year old kid, you know, using chipmunk sound effects. You know, I mean, people like that. I mean, to me, that's not really that entertaining. I mean, if he used his own voice. Then I could say, okay, you know, that could be a little entertaining. But the fact that he just kind of just, you know, talk like a fucking chipmunk, you know, I tell you. I don't know. Anyway. People that I know. See, I, a lot of people don't realize this, and they probably think, they look at me and they're like, boy, you just, you know, what, what are you trying to get at? You, you're just one guy. You can't change the face of YouTube. Well, of course not. But I know a lot of people who... I think should should be on a show like that, a YouTube show, or, or, or a certain show, like, or a stick cam show or something. People like Ron Fox, who I would say, as far as the year 2008, as far as, like, a radio DJ of the year, or internet DJ of the year, as far as I think, anyway, uh, I would give that appreciation and respect to Ron Fox, a.k.a. Ray, Big Ray Petty, if you ever go on his uh, stick cam shows, it's stickham.com slash, I believe, the Ronch Fox Network, I believe, uh, or Ronch Fox. A lot of people have heard of Ronch Fox. He, he uh, has been doing broadcasting, radio broadcasting for pretty much all his life. And uh, I've enjoyed his shows and whatnot on Stickham, as well as some of his videos on YouTube from his blog TV days and all that stuff, and his uh, prank calls. If you type in Ronch Fox, and that's Fox with three X's, uh, you'll see a lot of different varieties of uh, videos that he's done, which is, you know, is pretty pretty cool. I've chatted with him before, one-on-one. -on -one. He was a guest on one, one of my radio shows when I was doing radio at the actual radio station. So, you know, a lot of respect for that guy. He would be somebody that I would say, as far as the 2008 Internet uh, DJ of the of the year, I would say Ron Fox. Uh, speaking of another Fox, somebody else that I've chatted chat with and somebody who has a stick cam channel, somebody who used to be really popular on YouTube, uh, maybe not as much anymore, but you'll remember the names, or remember the name, uh, you probably won't know his real name, Matthew Gafford, but you'll know Frederick Fox, and he has a stick cam channel, stickcam.com slash Frederick Fox. As far as what I rate him, uh, I would say most appealing video personality of 2008. Uh, or just so, you know, because I, I, I got hooked up on his videos back in last year, in 2007, when I saw his Walmart videos, and I thought, you know, this guy is actually pretty good. And on his uh, site, uh, frederickfox.com, or frederick.com, uh, he has all his videos on there. And, you know, I've chatted with him on the sick camp before. He's a really cool guy. He lives in Birmingham, Alabama, so, you know, He's as southern as southern gets, but he's he's a good guy. And he's really funny, and you know he 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 can draw like like the best of them, you know, with the best of them. Uh, 
So as far as uh, video personality of the year, I would say uh, for 2008, I would say uh, Frederick Fox. Uh, there's another video personality that I'd say as far as creative, most creative or most creative or effort put in a video, uh, I would give that props to uh, uh, Sean McLean. And you're probably wondering, who the hell is Sean McLean? <laughs> A.K.A. Zara, Zara Nizrak? I think I said that right. That's his YouTube channel. Kind of odd to use the name, but anyway. He puts a lot of efforts in his videos. And he also has a stick app ch uh, channel too. And he, 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 he really puts a lot of effort in his videos. And I've been really impressed by his work and whatnot. His DVD updates. And, uh... He really goes beyond the beyond the creativity limit. Uh, uh, his videos are one of the few that are actually available in HD. He knew how to crack the code, you know. He knew how to do it, and uh, you know he he just does a great job. So Sean McLean, A.K.A. Zara Nizrak, as far as <coughs> for 2008, uh, most effort put in a video, uh, I'd say. That award goes to you. I see how much time we have here. Oh, we got plenty of time. Plenty of time. Okay. Okay. The list continues. Uh, there are two people who I would give this award to as far as uh, breakout people of the year of 2008 internet YouTube uh, breakout uh, subscribers or not subscribers, but more like. Uh, uh, channel providers, and that would be Cool Dooner, aka Sean Phillips and MJ Kelly, and Wet Movie One, aka Brendan Mitchell, <coughs> aka Mitchell Productions. Those two guys, or those three guys, as far as you know, making the YouTube history. I know Sean's been making Sean MJ's been doing videos for a long time, but no one. I think they got more bigger, uh, or more better, or better more. Uh, in 2008 because a lot of people recognize their work you know on their weekly uh, video blogs around the town videos uh, town of birth videos uh, just you know their movie cameos their Joe Franz videos just everything and you know they continue even as we speak to update their channel and all that stuff and they do stuff on stickham as well stickham.com slash down of birth is their site and Brendan Mitchell aka wet movie one uh, the, uh, a guy who, you know, maybe never thought he gained as much popularity as he has. I mean, I've saw videos of people actually making, paying tribute to him, you know, who've never met him, who probably never even talked to him, but put together a good video of some of his videos. He's a guy that I was introduced to back in April, kind of like the same I went to Sean MJ, uh, like after WrestleMania or whatever, between WrestleMania and Backlash for WWE pay per views. And before I went to my, uh, my trip to Astoria, Oregon, I got uh, started hearing him and whatnot and seeing his videos. And finally got a chance to actually chat with him on stick him. So as far as respect, those are the people that I give respect to. Ron Fox, Sean McLean, a.k.a. Zara Nizrak, Frederick Fox, Sean MJ, a.k.a. Cool Duder, and uh, What Movie One, Brendan Mitchell. Uh, people who who really deserve the credit for the work that they do as far as video editing, production, uh, the time it takes to make a video. Uh, just you know, people who I feel have really made the big breakout of 2008 and will continue to do that into 2009 and hopefully many years to come. And maybe one day I'll be on that list of people that can do good videos. I know my videos don't always, you know, do, you know, aren't always the greatest, but uh, you know, I got a cheap camera, so, and I don't have all the, all the great tools like everybody else does, so, you, you, you do what you can, you know, you work with what you can, but, uh, anyway, that's my rant, and we will see you when we see you. See you later.